in this video how to remove empty lists from a list in Python and we're gonna look at two primary ways of doing it either list comprehensions or using the filter built-in function and we're going to remove empty lists from a list so let's get into it first let's create a variable which we'll call new list and inside of this list uh, we'll have a range of different values so we'll do one two three uh, maybe a couple empty lists, um, an empty string, some more empty lists, uh, four or five. So we have three empty lists in here, a couple numbers and an empty string, and that is our new list variable. So now that we have our variable new list, um, let's try to create a second list um, filtering out those empty lists that we no longer need. So. Um, the first way we'll do this is using a list comprehension. So a normal list comprehension would look like x for x in new list. And that'll just kind of iterate over it and, and return all of our values because we're not filtering anything out yet. So if we want to add a filter to this list comprehension, um, basically we do it on the right side of the list comprehension and we'll do if x. And so what that is going to do is filter out all of the falsy values. And you'll notice that that has filtered out our empty string as well because an empty string is a falsy value. Now if we wanted to get even more specific and we wanted to keep other falsy values that are not empty lists such as that empty string, we could do something like this, if not empty list. And when we return that, we're going to get our empty string value because we're only concerned here about filtering out empty lists. And I could show you that um, we, could, we could do the opposite. We could filter out everything that's not an empty list. So hopefully uh, with these two kind of opposite operations, you kind of get the feel for it. Um, but of course, in this case, we want to filter out the empty lists and that's how you would do that with a list comprehension. Now the second way we can do this, again with our new list, is with the filter function. And first I want to wrap it in a list just so that you guys can get a good printout of it. And then we have our filter function inside there. And filter takes two arguments. So those arguments are callable and then an iterable. Right? So our iterable in this case is going to be new list. And our callable um, this is a bit of an unintuitive one, but first let's go with none. So when we run this, you'll see that it was kind of the same thing as our list comprehension, where it's getting rid of all of the falsy values, including uh, that empty string. So this is one way to do it, to filter out falsy values, kind of a cool trick for filtering falsy values using the filter built-in function, is using none as that first argument. Now again, I know some people might want to keep those falsy values such as an empty string and only filter out the empty list. So what we're going to do is use the lambda to accomplish that. So uh, the normal syntax is x, x. So lambda x colon x. And that'll basically work the exact same as the none. So you can see that that has filtered out all the falsy values once again. But uh, on the right side of this lambda here, we can do some stuff. So we can do uh, x um, does not equal empty list, and that is uh, the bread and butter. That's exactly what we're looking for. And you, you might remember I showed you the example with the list comprehension of doing the double equals. So if we only wanted empty lists, and again, kind of that same thing, but this time we're doing it with lambda instead of a list comprehension. And just to run it one more time, so if x does not equal an empty list, then we'll return that in our new list. So it's as easy as that. Um, here we have our lambda example. And let me just kind of clear the screen, show you this again, and I'm going to show you the list comprehension side by side. So to kind of wrap everything together, uh, we had our new list variable. And new list was a list that contained some integers, it contained empty lists, and it also contained an empty string. And the reason I put the empty string in here is because we're not just filtering out falsy values, 
um, and taking the easy way out, we really want to ensure that we're only filtering out empty lists. And so we figured out two ways to do that. Um, one, using a list comprehension, and the other way, using the filter function uh, with Lambda. And so these two things are basically equivalent in this situation, or at least their outputs are, are equivalent. Um, we have filtered out all of the empty lists, and we have returned the values that are not empty lists, regardless of if they're truth, truthy or falsy. Um, we were really specific and honed in on filtering out empty lists and returning a new list. So there you have it, two different ways to filter empty lists in your lists in Python. Thanks for watching.